Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel and happy Saturday from me and Jade and I. Um, today I'm going to try and do a little bit of laundry for her, um, do my scrubs and kind of take the rest of the day from there to be completely honest. Uh, I have some engagement planned for this weekend. It is one of my friend's son's birthday and, um, we had planned to go somewhere, but she reached out and said that it's not convenient for her for us to go anymore. So I'm trying to find out how to make my way to her and to them. They live in Connecticut. And so far, it does not really seem convenient. Like getting there with Mia does not seem convenient. And um, I'm so bothered because I already know that it's not convenient for me based on the different pieces of transportation that I'm going to have to take to get there while having her with me, possibly strapped onto me and having a bag with her, with us. The train station closest to me, it's not really accessible. I'd have to go uh, a few stations away for that accessibility of like an elevator, which I don't realize how, how important accessibility is until right now where I need the station to be accessible because I would have had Mia with me and a bag. Now, if it were a case where I don't have a bag and I just have her strapped onto me perfectly fine because I could climb the flights of stairs completely fine and it's okay, but I do have her and I will have a bag and you know, it's a bit much. And again, I can already see that it's not gonna be convenient for me. And it literally kind of breaks my heart because when I haven't seen my friend in so long, Two, it's made me realize that I need to get my license. Even though if I got my license, I wouldn't have bought a car immediately. It's just the convenience of it all. <laughs> Mia agrees. Just, you know, the convenience of the whole thing. And so, you know, that's where I'm at. And we're going back and forth trying to bounce ideas off of, I'll get to Stanford and she would pick me up. But it's getting there. That's not really convenient. And also now I'm wondering, like, What's the getting back going to be like? Because I'd be coming back on a Sunday. Just sounds like a lot. This morning I came home and I noticed that Mia was sleeping because her dad had picked her up a few minutes before I got here. Gave her a bottle and put her back to bed. And I didn't even want to open the entryway closet to be in there messing around with my bags and coat and everything. So I just brought it inside of the living room and I put it down. So now I'm going to put that away. So I just brought the two bags of laundry with me and I'm really going to just get started on that. Maybe put on a video or so from one of my favorite content creators and just kind of power through. I also have my homework that I want to make one final edit to and I want to submit it, but I definitely want to submit it today for sure because it's due in two days and I don't want to see it's already tell me submit on my career paper part one. So when I start the laundry, I'm going to go through, finish making my edits and submit um, the part one. I also got an email last night from the <coughs> academic advisor. And she was basically telling me that there's a math class that I need. <coughs> Wait a minute, it looked like the email wasn't sent. Oh yeah. Okay, so I have been added to Math 132 course sign up list. You have guaranteed seats summer 2024. Great. Here's the caveat it takes place on Tuesdays and Thursdays. But it's only going to be from June 3rd to August 15th. So I need to make sure that when I'm picking my next class, it doesn't. Repeat weekly.
every week. Oh, uh, custom. But yeah, that's gonna be Tuesdays and Thursdays and it's online and everything. You know, so I'm gonna start the laundry and stuff like that. Kinda get everything going. It's eleven fifteen AM and because um Mia's dad had taken her up um this morning and like giving her a bottle and stuff like that, I was able to sleep for about almost two hours when I came home. Which is good because yesterday morning I was really, really struggling and um uh, my mom ended up coming and taking her and I was able to get some sleep. So I'm very grateful. Hi Tukes. So I'm very grateful for that from you. I think tomorrow her aunt might take her. Still playing it by ear to see, I'm not really sure. Mainly because this week uh, she goes on vacation, so she wanted to take her before she goes on her vacation. Whatever works for her works for me, and I've told her that before. But also, if there's a week where she cannot take her, that's perfectly fine too. We'll always just pick back up the following week. Also, now that she's moving around, I have to make sure that I always go through and clean this kitchen floor because yesterday she picked up something and put it in her mouth that was just wild but um i'm gonna get started on the laundry and stuff like that and i'll see you guys later So I went through and separated the laundry and I've been very diligent about doing the laundry every week. Come on Mia. So that it never feels like the she's gonna come down here because she's obsessed with these little shoes that I have. <coughs> Mia. Hey baby. I'm gonna leave y'all here so you can see her crawl down here for the shoes. Hi guys, it's currently 1.23. God, Mia is down for her nap. I'm glad that I was able to take 
and not this morning because that gave me more than enough energy before discharging disconnecting that gave me more than enough energy to be able to do all of this that i'm doing right now i feel like i'm currently washing every single thing in this apartment um you know my mom is here and um so whatever little bit of stuff she wore this week plus my scrubs that i wore this week i'm washing those too plus i had a i had a linen from last week that i didn't um wash so I'm washing that now too but um yeah and i'm definitely washing my robe because i'm pretty sure there's spit up and all types of stuff on it i'm gonna wash it and um basically put that one up and it's gonna be time for the summer robes and stuff like that but yeah that's where we're at mm, 22 pastel pillow cover decor pillows for the some decor pillowcases for the couch I'm trying to like brighten it up a little bit oh this is very pretty love watching you clean up fast please do more somebody just commented on a video and i'm hi thank you for watching i also love watching sped up cleaning hi y'all it's currently 3 p.m as i'm seeing my nails i'm now realizing that my nails need to be redone may is still sleeping i think at this point she's been sleeping for about an hour she's been sleeping for an hour and 58 minutes that's two hours that i could have slept for and i think if i go in there now she's gonna wake up it doesn't even make any sense anymore but um i'm done with laundry i put out everything cleaned up the bathroom i ended up spilling some water on the bathroom mat so two of those are wet so when i go in the bedroom i'm gonna need to um get out a new mat to put in there um i took down this gift bag because i have <laughs> looks so feminine but also it's a baby it's not that serious really right um but also i'm gonna pack the baby's gift that i have for my friend's baby um i think Nia's awake i hear her mm -hmm. i'm gonna make her some milk right now my landlord said that or his son son-in-law whatever said that he is going to come and fix the light, change out the light fixture down there in the entry area. And I'm waiting for that. I need to buy that, um, that over the mirror light from Amazon. But, you know, these days, I've really been more focused on my priorities. Like, honestly, that light is not a priority, so I haven't bought it yet. But, you know, I'm taking my time and going through and, like, buying one little thing here and one little thing there. I just ate some food my mom made some turned cornmeal if you're not jamaican you're probably not gonna know what that is and if you are jamaican a lot of jamaicans probably think that's dog food but baby one time my mom made that with some steamed fish fire as hell my mom could really cook so i just heated some of that up with um some sausage and peppers that i made and i ate that just now i think i did mention that i'm meeting up with all my friends later um but i think it's later on my mom gets here like around 5 5 20 something like that so now that me is awake i don't know what i'm gonna do but i'm gonna make her this bottle and see if i can like hold her for a little bit and if she'll like go back to sleep or whatever if she doesn't want to that's completely fine but um yeah I'm very glad that I'm done doing laundry and everything. I had started editing this video, but for the most part, I was just sitting here uh, doing that stuff. And I'm glad that I'm like done. I mean, it's three o'clock basically took the whole time. I mean, if I started when I just came home, but I didn't too because um, her dad would have to shower to go to work and stuff like that. And you know, laundry typically takes about two hours. Um, I've been done for a while now and I started at like 12, so yeah bomb so I, I hung them out to dry and everything which you guys would have already seen and um right now i'm gonna just chill with her uh and wind down for the rest of the day i'm gonna meet up with my friend later maybe we're gonna grab something to eat and get some drinks i don't really know Ooh. i know this place in brooklyn that is a drive 
drive through I'm gonna recommend that we go there. I'm gonna make the baby a bottle, give her some milk, cuddle with her a little bit in bed, you know, just lay down, spend some time with her, really. Maybe I'll see you guys in the next vlog because I don't anticipate anything else happening right now. Um, and I'm definitely not gonna vlog when I meet up with my friend later on. I'm trying to be really intentional and like in the moment with <coughs> my friendships and stuff like that, you know, and so because of that, um, probably not gonna vlog. Probably not gonna vlog. That's where we're gonna end off today's video. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys in the next one.